Yeah, welcome back to another video. Just been uh, listening to the WAB lads. Um, just trying to get this scope bigger. Yeah, just listening. A bit waffle. Another waffle again today. Um, I'm just going to show you the setup um, uh, for the audio for the Heil microphones. Um, if you actually go to Bob Hiles' uh, site, he tells you every radio. But basically, the setup on this is is for articulation. I'm, all I'm doing is I'm uh, oh, yeah. I turn this down. I'm moving off frequency as well. All, all I'm doing is um, uh, doing it for articulation. So uh, I, I mostly work DX. I'm not into uh, uh, Voodoo audio and stuff. And to be quite frank. Um, You've got to have the voice for video audio. Um, a lot of people try it, they buy the racks, etc. And uh, yeah, it don't work out. But yeah, that's not my cup of tea. Um, I, I'm, I'm mainly working DX and uh, I want people to understand me. So uh, we'll have a quick uh, look at the settings. If you, if you do, if you are into video audio actually, um, uh, just a heads up. If you go to uh, YouTube and put uh, K1GMM, uh, Kilo One Golf Mike Mike Steve, um, he's a friend of mine, and uh, yeah, he does all the video audio. So anyway, let's have a look what what my settings are. Um, we're just trying to look around the camera here. Uh, levels. <coughs> I'll be looking up at the uh, big screen. Um, yeah, this is just some receive audio. Um, I have the bass on one, and I have the th uh, uh, the treble on three. Uh, if I get back on three, see these guys again. Well, well, I've gone to the USB. Like you can hear the difference with this. All the radios, Icon radios, used to come with uh, flat, which is there. Uh, so bass, I don't like too much bass, so I go, I go, I turn that down a little bit. I, t I, I, I uh, have the bass on one. Sorry, that's a treble. So I have treble on three. <laughs> Roger D. Um, yeah, turn this down again. Yeah, the bass I have on um, uh, plus one. So that's my receive side of things. You might have to set it up differently. Um, it makes no what, uh, odds what radio, it's any ICOM radio, it's, it's basically the same menu, uh, I, the same settings that I've got here, uh, I used to have on my 7300. Um, this is my transmit audio, uh, plus three on the treble, um, and minus two on the bass. Um, if you go back on this channel, and you, there's a couple of... Uh, um, People have sent me the actual uh, videos actually. Uh, I'm working VK and uh, I'm working um, um, a Scottish station, uh, Robbie. Um, so you can actually hear what my audio sounds like. Um, and obviously, if you've worked me, I've never had comp any complaints. And as I said, I, I want this for articulation, I don't want it for uh, um, voodoo audio. If I was chatting at night uh, on a bit of a net, um, I might put the bass to uh, minus and leave the treble at uh, three um just for, for ease of uh, comfort of, of me listening to, especially to local lads uh, one or two of the local lads as well they're, they're into the video audio so um i might actually put um my uh um filter level up because everything's set uh, see that's on number three so i might put that to 360 if there was an having video audio but like I said it's not my cup of tea I just usually use it there uh, but most of the time I transmit on 2.4 um, nine, well 99% of, of the time um, let's just escape this here escape put the scope back up um, me ALC I have it three quarters um, on the radio. Uh, let's move this across a bit. Um, I'm here. Uh, I'm, I'm just. I'm about ten o'clock on on the the mic gain. 
Um, uh, so I'm not overdriving the ALC. Um, what else? Yeah, my compression's wide. As you can see, I always run uh, my compression wide. Um, the only time that I change that, say I'm in a pile-up, I'm not getting through. I might go to mid, uh, or sometimes narrow. It sounds awful, uh, but you can get through a pile-up. But uh, most, 99% of the time, I'm on wide, and I usually get through. And, uh, yeah, this is what I'm pairing it up with. Uh, just lift this up for a second. Yeah, as I said before, uh, all the time when I'm on, on, on this radio... Uh, I always use headphones and mic, uh, I find it a lot easier. Uh, so this is the uh, Heil Pro 6 headphones, lovely set. Um, I had the Pro um, the mini mini headphones, but yeah they had a fault on it, so uh, yeah I've, I've upgraded to this uh, set of headphones. Uh, uh, fantastic, I did the uh, uh, competition at weekend, I had a great time actually, like I said it was just a chilled one. Uh, and I just did 10 meters. I probably put in eight hours, if that, four, four, four maybe four to maybe five hours on sat uh, Sunday. Uh, but Saturday, I only put about four hours in. Um, so that's uh, one of the uh, uh, microphones. Sorry about the wobbly video. That's one of the uh, uh, Heil mics I use. And this the particular mic here, I was bringing it into shot, um, is the Heil Goal Line microphone, um, uh, the GM5. This is a lovely microphone. I used this for years, uh, but this one now I, I just use for uh, uh, for rag chew. Uh, like I said, if I was on a local net at night time, I can just swing this towards me, and uh, I usually pair it up with. Um, is it coming into focus? The BHI uh, headset, but uh, yeah, this is uh, just connected to the side of the table, so it spins. It spins to me, so I'm not actually moving anywhere. Um, that's why I like the the headsets. Um, you just um, you can sit back in the chair. Well, I can sit back in the chair with this thing as well. Uh, let's put this back out of the way. And the, the last microphone that I use, uh, this is for t uh, two meters. It's, it's paired up with the uh, 9100. Um, this is well, it's not. I'm not like it's a shot there. Uh, yeah, that's better. Uh, this is the SM30 uh, uh, microphone. Fantastic. Uh, uh, um, mic as well uh, I've actually used this on HF as well uh, not on uh, no complaints same setup in the audio um, and uh, yeah this is it's quite a punchy mic this but uh, yeah I usually use that for two meters so uh, I'm not trying to drag stuff about I just have it on the table and uh, I'm in the operate usually I'm in the operating position for HF and uh, I'm chatting to the guys as, as I'm doing both things uh, especially good for them on FT8 um, I could talk to you you're not you're not um, Turn the volume down and stuff. Uh, you just doing. I just do the FTA and I'll be chatting away. So, like I said, just a, a quick video today. This is uh, just the microphones that uh, I've got at this QTH, um, and they're all good microphones. I've got no complaints. And just another one. I'm not affiliated, uh, but they are friends of mine that uh, own this website. A um, uh, guy called Mick and John. Um, uh, but John uh, is yeah he's fairly close to me. Um, is well he's a close friend of mine. He's, he's like me Elmer. If you want to know anything, uh, he, he just uh, he just knows it. Um, uh, very clever fellow. Uh, and Mick is the uh, uh, like I said the other uh, owner of the website. He's a whiz on computers. Uh, fantastic chap. If you ever wanted to know anything about. Uh, uh, D Star Fusion, etc. Uh, it can do it, but yeah, this website this is a, a free website. Um, all you do is register your call sign and um, you put a password in. But remember your password because a lot of people say, I don't know my password. They say, Neither do we, <laughs> uh, but uh, yeah, um, uh, great, great, great uh, website. It's all free, you don't have to pay for it. Uh, they do this out of the goodness of art, these two. I, don't, uh, I wouldn't have the patience to do it. Handradiodeals.co.uk. Uh, um, it, it turns over a lot of gear. Uh, so it's just a good one uh, if, if you're looking uh, for, for some cheap uh, radio stuff. Um, because we all can't go, uh, afford to go to the main dealers. Uh, for instance, uh, if I move this out of the way, um, the 9100 and... Uh, this 7700 um, just a, for instance this actually uh, stands me at 2,000 pound for both radios um, 
I told John I wanted a, a 9100 and uh, uh, this was in, in a lot with the guy that owned it and he dealt some gear up uh, I don't actually use Cass he, he, he just deals me uh, stuff up everything you see on this table uh, is dealt up and it's all been dealt up from an FT2000 and, and like I said he, he just well the guy just looks after me um, finds out where stuff is asking if I'm interested I, I say what I want he, he asks me if I'm interested and he usually comes with me to make every show everything's okay. He, yeah, he holds me hand. So, uh, yeah, good one. Like I said, it was just a, a quick one today. Um, just showing this setup that I use uh, on this uh, particular radio. Um, and, the, and the microphones I use. Uh, all higher stuff here, except for the SM30, the Icom. Uh, like I said, which use that one for two meters. And uh, the, that's the settings for... Uh, um, um, the the mics and like I said if you go to um, uh, Heil Sounds website um, they've got all the all the radios up there Isle, um Kenwood, Yesu etc it tells you all the mic settings so uh, yeah I've not sussed all this out myself it's uh, all been Bob Isle so thanks Bob okay like I said quick one um, Enjoyed, I enjoyed the contest and uh, I'm going to send seven of threes for now from uh, G1 OFSN and G0DTX Shack. And uh, we'll catch you in the next one. I hope uh, this has been some interest to someone. Bye bye for now.